Hey, what's going on, man? It's Jarvis, man. Kingdom Lawn Care. I ain't writing nothing down. This ain't scripted or nothing. I just had a little thought. Uh, pause that real quick. Take these headphones off. But anyway, man, it's currently storming. I'm talking about, man, it's getting down. It been, it's Thursday. It's been raining since Monday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And then today it's still raining. But, hey, we out here. Like I always say, man, you can't sit around. You got to get out because it's always something you can do. Uh, I got a couple of landscaping jobs I got to do. I need to go pick up some pine straw and stuff like that. But uh, anyway, man, I had a thought. You know, uh, I just wanted to share this with y'all. I'm going to try to get it across because I ain't hardly, I didn't hardly give it no uh, forethought. And it's loud, man. That rain loud. But I, I really didn't give this no forethought on how, you know, how I'm going to uh, say this and present this on uh, on this video. But I just want to say, in, be, in, in everything, this is in life, period. If somebody is naturally fast, they can you can train them to be a track star. It'll be easy to train them to be a track star because they're naturally fast. Somebody naturally strong, you can train them to to be a, a, a weightlifter, a professional weightlifter, or whatever you know. Uh, everybody not naturally fast. Everybody not uh, naturally strong. And the thing about it, people that's that's less naturally strong are not naturally strong at all, or less naturally fast, or not naturally fast at all, you cannot train them to be a track star. You can train them to run faster and do better, but you cannot train them to be a track star. Uh, and it's the same exact thing in business. Somebody that don't have a business mind Somebody that don't have a business mind, you cannot train them to, to have a big, wonderful, successful business. It's just not going to work because it's too, it's too many uh, complex things that come with it that they won't understand. And, that, and when the obstacles come, it's time to use the money uh, to, to learn how to, to transport the money or to grow the business. That stuff have to be naturally in us uh, versus, you know, somebody trying to put it in us. And, yeah, they might give us the clues or you might you may tell somebody all the time how, how they could grow and how they could do something better. But if it's if they not already a track star, if they not already naturally fast, they are not going to be a track star. I'm sorry. If you don't already have a, some kind of a business mind, you are not going to grow a big successful business before before the internet and all this stuff people that that's going to be successful and they got a business mind they had they was already doing great things in business you know what i'm saying like in their business it may not be as professional and now it's a whole lot of uh, different uh tools to help you organize your business and, and, and teach you step by step what to do in business but at the same time, I'm gonna say it like this. I'm gonna give you this example. I, I haven't purchased nothing to help me grow my business and get my business in order. And do, am I knocking that? No, I think a lot of it is good. You know, especially for time's sake. You know, if you go get a postcard that's already pre-made, you know, for thirty dollars, it, it's kind of common sense to purchase that. You know, it, instead of spending the time making it and you won't never see it unless you done sat and made postcards before but uh i'm not knocking that but this example right here before before anybody ever said anything to me i had already knew that hey i need all this money that i'm making i need to set it aside for my business this my business money okay kingdom lawn care is making this much money but I ain't made nothing. I'm, I'm, I have to pay myself some money. In other words, I know a whole lot of people that just cut grass and they want to call themselves a business. But when they get, and I, I implemented this in my business long ago, and I squared it up a whole lot more now. But when I got paid, just say if I made $500 that week, let's just say $500. 
I put $400 back into my business for overhead, you know, even, even if I didn't need nothing. And even when I left my full-time job a couple of years ago, I told my wife, I said, I don't care if, if the business account have $20,000 in it and, and our personal account only got 300. That's just what it's going to be because that business got that much money, but that don't mean I have that much money. It's a lot of people, they go out there and they'll cut grass. They may make a lot of money. They may make a $1,000 that they rolling solo. They'll get that $1,000 and they'll put it all in their in pocket. You know, they ain't got no nowhere that they're going to put it for their business, but they'll put it all in their pocket. Then when they need some gas, they're going to get some gas and they'll pull out of that. But you can't you can't keep track. And see, that's something that you cannot teach somebody that's not naturally fast or, or natural, got a, uh, a business mind. You can't you can't teach nobody that don't have that mind. Because they have that's something so common sense that they have to already be in them. And I'm not saying if you're not doing that that you don't have common sense, but eventually you will you will see that you need to start doing that anyway without nobody having to tell you about it. You know, you 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 will already start implementing everything in your business that's gonna make you better without people having to tell you to do it. And it's a lot of stuff. Yeah, they they say you could just do this step by step. But at the same time, at the end of the day, when you see twenty thousand dollars in your in your business account, how you gonna react? You know what I'm saying? You, what you gonna do? And, and when it's time to invest, you want to grow a big successful business. But when it's time to 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 use that twenty thousand dollars in a smart way and make a make a good business move, what you gonna do? Will you just take the money and just go do whatever you want to? Or are you going to grow your business? So I just wanted to share that, man. If, if, if you know, if somebody already naturally fast, it's easy. You can teach them a whole lot. And it's going gonna, it's gonna to turn them into a track star. Somebody that's already naturally fast, it's going to turn them into a track star. It's not just going to make them just a little bit faster, but they already have it natural. Everybody in this world is not built to be a business owner. It's a whole lot, man, that come behind, you know, being a business owner. It's a lot of sleepless nights, you know. It's a lot of uh, stuff to go into it. It's time to shave, man. I'm itching. But it's a lot, man, to go into it, you know, that uh, that we have to do in our business to, uh, to help us, man, to be, you know, smart business owners, so... I encourage y'all, man, more than anything, you know, uh, if you if you find yourself lacking that stuff, try it. You know, just try it and see if you, because when we born, it's not wrote on our birth certificate. Oh, you are, uh, are going to be a business owner. You have a business mind. You know, you are very business minded. Nah, it don't say that. So we don't know what we are until we jump out there and try it. But if you jump out there and try, and try running a business and then you find yourself never doing smart business moves, I'm just being real with you. You might be an employee. I know this one ain't going uh, to go over well, but one thing about it, boy, we're going to keep it real on this one. You might just be an employee. You might have an employee mind if you can't see, see smart business moves without nobody having to tell you. So... Anyway, man, y'all take that for what it's worth. Make sure y'all like, man, subscribe to the video, man. We out.